guys are watching the Gen Z channel. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button right now. Today, we are in Georgetown, Kentucky. Yesterday was Monday, it's a Tuesday today, so we went down from home, Lexington, Kentucky yesterday, down to Commerce, Georgia, which is an Atlanta area. We unloaded there, then we went to Chattanooga, loaded up Volkswagens, and that's what I'm loaded with right now. I made it up to Georgetown, Kentucky, and we are starting off. It is 10 a.m. I did a good job over sleeping last night, that's for sure. We're starting off from here. We got three drops in Cincinnati for today. Pretty easy ones, I've been to all of them. Once we get those cars dropped in Cincinnati, we're going down to Georgetown. We're loading back up to Commerce, Georgia. Sounds like a whole lot of fun, so let's get right into this video. Let's start this day off. Before we hop right into the video, I just want to tell you guys, we got some big exciting news for this video. I went ahead and I bought myself a drone. That's gonna change a lot of the footage that I get from my YouTube channel. For example, when I do my time lapses of me unloading or loading, I can now do it from the air and get an aerial view of that. A drone is something that I've always wanted to get and I decided to finally hop right into it and get this drone. So this is the drone I got. This is a DJI Mavic 3 Classic. It came with the smart remote where I don't even need to put my phone into the remote because it has its own screen. And this screen is digital and it's as big as my iPhone and I was confused at first because I thought that this was a legit iPhone. How good the quality is, the keyboard, everything about it, it's awesome. I have been slowly practicing how to fly this thing. I have not hit anything yet. It's been going good. And I'm just super excited to share with you that I got this drone. I wouldn't be able to get this drone without you guys. You guys have been really supportive. You have been commenting, you have been liking. Also, we hit 6,000 subscribers, and I was like, maybe it's time to hop right into it because I've always wanted to get a drone for my channel. So this is some big news for me. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited because I'm gonna be filming clips like this. excited for these new drone shots quickly hit that like button so that I know that you guys are excited for it but now I can fly anywhere I want over anything I want I can even help myself back into spots with this thing if I really needed to but that's not why I got it I got it just for YouTube channel just for you guys thank you so much again I can't wait to start a lot of new video ideas that I have in mind and this thing will help me make that possible this thing was not cheap but with the help of car hauling this made it easy to buy. I went to Best Buy to try to get a drone. They were all sold out, out of stock. So I went to Amazon, ordered this thing, and it came a day later. This puppy cost me $1,700, but guess what? It's a business expense for car hauling and for my YouTube channel. So let's get this video rolling. Let's get our day started. But before we do, let's hop on out here, make sure that the truck is in good condition, all the wheels, do our pre-trip inspection, and then we'll hit the road. Standing next to the beautiful blue truck, it's a beautiful morning out here. It's already like 80 degrees outside with only being 10 a.m. It's a little bit too hot. So here's what I'm loaded with today. A bunch of Volkswagen Atlases, one electric one right there. Actually, we got another electric one right there as well. But we are sitting pretty here, right next to the weight scale. This is where we spent the night because there's nowhere else to park at the truck stops except for areas like this. So as we're just getting our day started, so are so many other people. We got a big oversized load coming through over here. Not so bad. Like I said earlier, I overslept last night. I was supposed to leave at 8 a.m. It's already 10, but I'm not in no rush. I'm not in no hurry because we need to get a rest. Any extra sleep that we can get is a bonus for us. But yeah, there's the big bad boy truck. Let's hop on in it and let's go to our first drop.
Joseph Volkswagen of Cincinnati just received four new cars from Brothers Transport. That was an easy drop. We got him off and then in like 10, 15 minutes, now we're waiting for someone to come sign for them. I hope you enjoyed that air time lapse that I just did for you guys. And next drop, we're gonna be dropping two more cars at a second drop and then two more cars at our third drop. So let's hop on in and let's keep going. So we are at our second drop. We just gotta drop off two cars here. It's a Volkswagen Atlas and a Volkswagen ID4. So what we're gonna have to do is lift this top deck, take that one out of there, but after we take this one off. Let's get to work. Super simple drops today. I've been to all of these dealerships. We got one more on the line. We gotta head there. It's about 21 minutes away. And we only got two more cars on the truck. Let's head over there. Let's get these puppies off of the truck and then head down to Georgetown, Kentucky to pick up nine units from there. Catch you at the next drop. So we have made it to our last drop. The dealership is somewhere right over there. We are parked up a hill. We got two more cars to unload over here. Let's get that aerial view and let's drop these two cars.
I just got back in the truck. I looked at the footage. I realized that my camera stopped recording as soon as I was sliding my trailer ramp into the second position. And I wasn't able to get two vehicles that I was offloading on video, but that's all right. I'm still learning. I'll get better with this camera stuff. I don't know why it shut off. I have enough storage and space on the camera and hard drive. So maybe it was just a little glitch, but we'll keep learning with time. Now we are done with this drop. I got my signatures. All drops went smoothly. It's been a really easy day. Now it's time to head down to Georgetown, Kentucky. We gotta load up some new Toyotas there. They do not allow drone flying, so no drone flying there. Maybe when we get out of there, but let's head over there. Let's throw nine cars onto our truck and let's continue with our day. Just stopped here for a quick minute to grab some food and our food today is sponsored by Chipotle. It's sponsored by Chipotle because I'm eating it and it's in my video, but I paid for it. So let's dig in and let's keep going. We have made it to Georgetown, Kentucky. We're in the plant. We're gonna be loading nine Toyotas here. It's a nice warm, day outside let's get on out and let's break a sweat our first car is on let's go grab the second one
on the road we got seven hours to go from Georgetown to Commerce Georgia loading up was successful quite easy we did break a little sweat it was hot outside I'm actually gonna be unloading tomorrow hopefully before noon we got three major cities before us Lexington Knoxville and Georgia let's hope we don't hit any traffic let's get there and let's get these cars dropped there but maybe you're gonna see that in the next video because that's gonna wrap up the video for today I had a fun time flying that drone around. It's not as time consuming as I thought it'd be. It even has a vehicle tracker where you put the vehicle tracker on and it tracks the vehicle that's on top of your truck. So that's pretty cool. But for now, thank you so much for watching. If you got to this part, you're the best. Hit that like button if you're new to the channel. Subscribe. Have a great night, morning or afternoon, whenever you're watching this. And I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned.